today i am presenting you an important slit lamp examination technique as well as a patient 15 years old male who came with complaints of glare and sensitivity increased sensitivity in bright light his vision was 66 in both eyes so we performed slit lamp examination and found this central opacity in the lens and diagnosed him as a case of blue dot congenital cataracts in both eyes now in this video we are also explaining how to perform one of the most important and most common slit lamp slit lamp examination technique and that is called direct illumination technique or direct focal illumination technique or optical section so in this technique the microscope is usually directed straight ahead and a thin bright full height beam is directed obliquely with an angle between 30 to 60 degree to give you detailed cross-sectional view of corneal layers anterior chamber and lens layers you can assess the exact depth of the lesion with this technique like in this patient if you keenly observe we have focused the lens and you can clearly see that the cortex anterior and posterior to the nucleus is clear and the central nucleus has got these white dot like opacities so we have exactly located the depth of the opacity similarly you can focus it on the cornea and see whether cornea as a whole is involved or specific lamellae are involved we use this direct illumination technique for majority of pathologies while using slit lamp observe how good the blue dot cataract is highlighted we gave sunglasses and chose to observe this blue dot cataract because it was insignificant at that point in time so if his vision deteriorates or the symptoms worsens then we can discuss other options so this technique direct illumination technique also tells you about the corneal thinning anterior and posterior lenticonus anterior chamber depth along with the exact location and depth of the lesions so mastering direct illumination technique is the most important technique to see patients on the slit lamp and it's very easy to master just the viewing beam should be straight ahead whereas the illumination beam will be angled 30 to 60 degrees and then you have to focus the area of interest like here you can clearly see the lens in a cross-sectional way and you can see the transparent anterior and posterior lens and in the center these white tiny dot like opacities so that was all about the direct focal illumination technique and blue dot cataract i hope after watching this video you will be able to perform this very important slit lamp examination technique thank you very much